What's up gamers, GamerDad here. This is a guide to help you complete the Fortnite Mares Quest deal damage to opponents with legendary or higher rarity weapons. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do hit that button and show me that support. And don't forget to use my creator code in your Fortnite item shop. It is GamerDad, all one word, all capital letters. I greatly appreciate your support. So things to note here. You can deal damage to opponents. This includes players, low card guards, and dealers slash bosses. So that's great. And I've confirmed the low card guards and the boss do count for the damage. And then you need, but the key here is it has to be with a legendary or higher rarity weapon. So legendary um, or mythic. And I might be forgetting one rarity in there, but how can you get these items? Well, at these three vaults at Sanguine Suites, Eclipse Estate, or um, Relentless Retreat, you can get into the vault and get legendary items in there. But you can also buy a um the heisted accelerant shotgun from heartbreak ranger at rumble ruins now this is a exotic weapon and that was the other so it's legendary exotic or mythic so if you've got the gold you can go there another way to do it is when you come to a forecast tower after the first storm circle the forecast towers will have a boss and two low card guards spawn if you eliminate the boss he actually drops a legendary weapon now, for me, I'm going to land at the Drift Ridge Racetrack here. There's also a few other ways to get it. You can actually get yourself a lower rarity weapon and then upgrade it, or you can buy from a hollow chest. So first off, opening up this chest, here's this weapon. It is an uncommon twig mag, twin mag assault rifle. Opening up another chest over here. Immediately, when, this is an epic suppressed pistol. So neither of these weapons will count. It goes from it goes from common to uncommon, then to rare, then to epic, and then to legendary and higher. So you can take any weapon and go to an upgrade station like this, interact with it, and you can upgrade. And and here's hollow chest. If you have keys, you can open it and take this tactical DMR, for example. You could open up that um, hollow chest with a key. And don't forget, there's the key master augment that you can use, um, or you can find keys on the ground. If you need gold. Hopefully you've got some. You can open, you get gold from eliminated players. You can get them from safes like this. And now the best part is it's bargain week because it's the end of the season. So things are cheap, like upgrades. And that's a huge bonus here. I wouldn't search too hard. And if you don't want to go all the way to Love Ranger at Rumble Ruins and try to fight people, I recommend coming right here to where I am. Get yourself a weapon and come over to the upgrade station and just use it. So I'm upgrading from uncommon all the way to legendary. That's 125 gold. 187 so we're like 300 and then 250 so 550 gold bars to upgrade from an uncommon to legendary i've got so much gold i'm also going to upgrade the sharp tooth shotgun i've got and at one point i'm going to pick up a dmr and go up back and upgrade it as well now we need opponents so first off there's players so this player here is shooting up at, at me here i'm gonna fire knock their build down i'm gonna get 50 damage here then i'm gonna go over uh, i'm gonna try and build up do some build here they're going to break it down but then i'm going to use my sharp tooth shotgun to eliminate this player fairly easily of course and then we've got 100 of 500 damage complete now my plan here is to go over and wait for the low card guards and the dealer to spawn right by this forecast tower and so i'm basically making my way over there um there's a player here i'm going to eliminate them on my way there there we go Bill, there's a uh, a little wall, I'm going to come around the wall, get two more shots on that player, and they are now eliminated. That is 207 of 500 damage required. It's definitely going to be key for you to have um, 100 health, 100 shields before you embark on this journey here. So I was coming over, waiting for the card and dealer, to, low card guards and the dealer to spawn. This player is there. I used that Witch's Broom to kind of throw the player off, and then come from behind. Totally got them all messed up. Eliminate them. That's 357 of 500 from three players. Now all I'm going to do is the guard is right there. I'm going to use my DMR and shoot at them from afar. And the challenge is complete. It's as simple as that. So I do hope the guide is helpful for you. Please drop a like. Leave me a comment. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please do hit that button and show me that support. And don't forget to use my creator code in your Fortnite item shop. It is GamerDad. All one word. All capital letters. Thank you so much for your support. Good luck with your challenge. And until the next video, this is GamerDad. Out.